for a very long time i was always overweight i was always the fat friend i never wanted to take my shirt off in public and it restricted me so much i didn't even feel comfortable wearing a jumper sometimes but one day i saw my dad compete i saw him up there on stage and i thought that's gonna be me i'm going to be that guy and ever since that day I've always had that dream, and now <laughs> it's time to show everyone what I can do. Friday morning, um, this is the day before the show, uh, so this is what I'm having for breakfast, I'm having my normal eggs, but I've got 50 grams of white rice in there, because I've started carb loading, started yesterday obviously with dinner, and then I've still got my 250 mils of protein shake, and then my coffee, but uh, I'm going to have to stop drinking water as I need to dehydrate myself to really make sure my vascularity is popping, but yeah. Gonna go to school, then we're gonna leave here and get in the car and go to Hamilton. So yeah, that's pretty much the plan for the day. Friday lunchtime, I'm having my chicken and rice. They actually didn't have any veggies, which is a bit of a surprise. So pretty much at the moment I'm carb loading, which is when, because I've been like carb depleted for so long, I obviously need to start carb loading a couple days before my comp. So that way like on the day when I have heaps of carbs and my body knows how to react properly and like, you know, pump pump me up a bit. So I look more full on stage. So that's cool. Which is why I had um, chicken and rice and veggies last night. So yeah, I'm actually looking pretty forward to eating this, but I finished my English and then I think once dad gets home, which probably isn't even that far away, we're just gonna leave. So I'm gonna eat this and yeah. I will see you in the car, probably, away or a bit closer to Hamilton, I hope. Mm. Oh, that's so good. Alright, see you in a bit. Alright, we made it to the chicken, so we checked nah. in. We're about to get the tan. Oh, how many? Um, we got my number 38 in the trunks. So, yeah, now I'm just gonna wait for the tan, which will probably be a while. Alright, we finished up with the tanning. Um, gonna be having dinner soon. It's pretty late, it's like 9 o'clock, but I just figured. Look at this. Like, I am so bronze, I love it. Feels great. Feeling pretty confident, gonna do a huge posing practice tonight. And then get up early, have dinner. I mean, well, I have breakfast actually. But yeah, we we should be rocking. We'll be good. Hopefully we get heaps of footage of the thing, but yeah. I'll see you after dinner probably, so yeah. Yeah, all right, that's Friday night. I look very weird because of the thing, <laughs> as you can see got the tan on we're looking good we're looking solid um yeah far out they need to do my face because it's not it's not very tan compared to the rest of me but just had a shot of vodka i'm probably gonna pass out soon because i haven't had any water to follow it back because i'm trying to dehydrate so yeah this was friday and tomorrow is show day i'm nervous i'm excited but yeah we get it It is Saturday, it's show day. I think we're all pretty excited. I certainly am. Um, 
I look quite funny at the moment because then tan my face and my face is white and I'm, I'm bronze as hell. Ready for the last little physique check. Not that much is really going to change between now and then. But, oh, this is so hard to try, but good thing I don't have my trap book over there. Dunno, dunno, feels good, feels great. I'm feeling bronze. Love and life. Um I can finally eat flavor again today, so it's gonna be a good day, it's gonna be a good day. Alright, we are gonna go get a tan. Another like stage tan, because this isn't dark enough and some of it came off in the night. But first we're gonna have breakfast, I'm just gonna have eggs and a few rice cakes with some squeezable honey. Uh just to get the carbs in. So yeah. I will see you probably getting a stage tan. So yeah. Alright, I've cooked breakfast. This is what it's looking like. We've got um, egg whites on toast and some honeys on there just for the carbs. Because there's about 37 grams, oh sorry, 18 grams of carbs and like one tablespoon of squeezable honey, which is what we have. And there's about 18 grams of carbs or 23 grams in the white toast, just two pieces. Um, so we're just going to have some carbs to kind of fill ourselves up a bit. Hey Dad, flex your abs. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well Dad's looking insane. We're both looking pretty good, feeling pretty confident, but you never know. We might say that and then some guys just decided to enter last night, who's like an absolute monster, but we'll see anyway, we'll see. Alright, we made it, we're getting the base tan, it's pretty loud, but see that. See everyone, but yeah, feeling pretty good. All right, we got the second tan on, so stage tan is done. Dad's just getting his now, or waiting, and then we're gonna go to the venue and get a briefing, and then pretty much we're gonna be waiting all day. But yeah, feeling pretty good. My sock fell off, which is a sock you have to wear over your uh, penis, so when they spray you, but mine fell off, so it's all right. But um, no, we're feeling good, looking pretty lean. So pretty much everything's come down to this. Had a few rice cakes today, had a lot of carbs, so I'm feeling a bit full. As in like, my body's feeling full. I physically don't feel hungry at all. I need to eat more. I'm gonna have some squeezable honey, but yeah, we're rocking. All right, we've made it in. Um, I'm next to Scotty here. <laughs> uh, I think it's just us two so far for the teenage bodybuilding, so that's all right. But um, this is kind of what it looks like. So we're just in like a big kind of room with plastic everywhere. It's pretty all good to be honest. It's pretty cold though. My bum's probably gonna get sore because there's like no padding anywhere. There's some warm water over there as well. Oh yeah. Okay. And there's some warm water over there, so that's good for me. But um yeah, it's gonna be a long day, but I'm pretty excited just to get on stage. So yeah. Alright, we just finished team bodybuilding. Um it was just me and Scotty in the class. So I don't know how it went, but now I'm moving into the physique, got the board shots on and everything, but yeah. It's pretty hectic and it gets pretty hot up there, but I feel right so far. Pretty supportive people, but yeah. Alright, we finished the classic physique. Oh, not classic, sorry. Just the men, teenage bodybuilding physique, whatever. Um, don't know. Feeling pretty average after it. But we'll see how it goes at the finals. So yeah, All right, just to give you guys a bit of a kind of inkling to what, what it's like here. Let's go. So, he's a fucking monster. And then I'm sitting here, my skinny little ass, eating some rice cakes, trying to look big, get full. And then he goes right there. But luckily I'm not competing against him. Just competing against Scotty who's still bigger than me so <laughs> it's all right but this is just a learning curve and then next year we're gonna try and take it all out get a proper posing just get everything done properly but yeah it's all in the all in the build-up so now we're just waiting for finals to happen which I think is about an hour and then we're gonna hit the <coughs> best cheat meal of our lives or well, my life anyway but um I think I think finals is in an hour, so I have to go up do my routine for class uh, for the bodybuilding, and then I go back and do my posing for the physique, and we do like the finals, and then you get your awards if you get any. But yeah, it's pretty hard to know what's going to happen. 
but it's been a decent day. Um, Dad, what would you think of the day so far? Or how do you think you've gone? Okay. Not great, not good. Just okay. Well, there's Dad's descriptive answer. But yeah, I will probably see you after finals. Alright, we're just warming up the finals and then gonna go on stage, do the routine, come off and jump straight into the board shorts and then probably go from there. Scotty's warming up, looking sexy. Stressful now. Stressful, yeah. Stressful, yeah. Fair enough. But um, it's just us two, so it's alright. Okay, I'll probably see you back after the finals, so yeah. Alright, we finished the bodybuilding. Got second place, Scott got first. But he's just an absolute weapon. And then I've got the board shorts on now, and we're gonna go to the physique. So, yeah, hopefully that goes well. Don't know where our place for that, but it's all the learning curve. So, yeah, I'll see you after that. Alright, well, we're all done. Finals is over. Um, I got third place in the physique, and then second place in the bodybuilding. Um, so, it was alright. That was more for the experience, in my opinion. But um, it is what it is. Gonna try and bulk next year, get a lot bigger, come back, smash teenagers. Okay, that sounds bad, but you know what I mean. <laughs> and then um, almost die because mum doesn't know how to drive, apparently. <laughs> Alright, so it's pretty much like, I oh, don't even know. A long time, almost a month and a half after the comp and I've only just kind of got the motivation to post this. I'm not too sure what happened, kind of just went through a bit of a, uh, just a weird spot really after you compete, like, because you're so restricted, you're so committed to this one thing and then the second it happens you're like, what the fuck, like what do I do now? So there's a, there's a fly. Um, but no, honestly, I really hope you guys have enjoyed the video. I think what I was going to go on to say was that I just want to bulk up and like come come so much heavier to the stage next year and just really like really just you know at the stage so um that's pretty much what i'm doing i'm gonna be bulking from well now like literally november 2022 all the way through to like i'm gonna say june or july probably june um of 2023 and then uh yeah, we're going to start a cut, but I want to put on, like, a good 10 to 12 kilos. I want to, I, like, <laughs> I want to be big, so that's, that's the goal. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm going to try and upload a few more videos, hopefully. So if there's anything in specific that you want to see, um, just comment down below. But thank you so much for watching. Um, thank you also so much for the support throughout the, throughout the entirety of this kind of competition. It was the mental, like... Mentally the hardest thing I've ever done in my life. Um, physically the hardest thing I've ever done in my life. Um, but it's it's been an amazing journey. And I'm just very happy, not only for me, but also for you guys that I've documented it so that I can look back on this in the future and know where I started and how everything's changed. So it's cool that you guys can also join me on that journey. But thank you so much for watching. Would really appreciate a like. Um, a comment, subscribe if you really like me, I don't know. But yeah, thank you so much.